वेलकम बैक टू कैड कैम ट्यूटोरियल टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्केच एंड असम्बल दिस डिस्क ब्रेक सो लेट्स सी हाउ टू असम्बल स्केच एंड असम्बल इन सॉलिड वर्क सो लेट्स स्टार्ट नाउ वी विल स्केच फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ डिस्क ब्रेक डिस्क सो लेट्स स्टार्ट चूज फ्रंट राइट प्लेन स्केच ड्रॉ ए सर्कल फ्रॉम ओरिजिन पॉइंट एंड कीप द डायमीटर 174.54. Now exit and choose extruded boss and keep thickness 4.5 mm. Okay. Now select this face sketch normal. Now we want to make some hole here, so just create a circle and keep the diameter. 99.44 mm okay now exit select extruded cut we want to cut through all okay now see the whole saw created select this face sketch normal now create a circle here choose circle and draw a circle select here for construction okay now assign dimension One hundred ten point eighty three mm. Okay. Select center line and draw one center line from one end to one end. Exit. Now choose circle and draw two small circles here. One, two. Now assign the diameter. Keep diameter two point five six. and make relation both the circle should be equal select here equal now assign the gap make that gap 10 mm and distance from here to this line is 22.32 mm okay Now choose center line and draw two center lines. Exit. Again select center line and draw from this hole. Now exit. Now we will define some angle between these lines. Eighty-four point two nine degree. and this angle cancel it and delete this relation now again choose distance angle now you can define before 90 degree 95.29 degree select okay now this is your your angle now we want to make linear pattern choose linear pattern delete this select this circle and select this axis clear select only this axis and uh, choose direction i think this method is not suitable for this so cancel it and we will draw manually just expand these angles and everything draw some eight or nine circles we want nine circles
it will take more time just expand just expand this line delete this circle expand this construction line One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We want two more. Now exit. Now select this all circles. S select this circles and okay. We will choose one by one. Read this face. Okay, now make here relation equal. Now see all circles are equal. Now assign gap. Five mm. Now the same as we will assign gap here also 5 mm five mm five mm Okay, now assign relation, select this circle and select one by one this all nine circles. Make relation equal. Select okay. Now we will select extrude cut. Extruded cut. We will choose through all. Okay. Now the holes are created. This is the holes for breaking. Let's move for another. Now we will rotate this cutout. So choose circular pattern. Select this cutouts. And choose this circle as an axis. And we want seven number of holes equal seven number of pattern equal spacing okay now see the holes are created now select this face sketch normal now we will create one geometry here exit now select three point corner rectangle and draw a rectangle like this exit now assign dimension from here to this point 2.84 mm and the degree keep the degree 66 and the gap Nine zero point nine four mm and the length keep forty mm. Select OK. 
Now select extruded cut and depth only up to points 0.67. Okay. Now choose fillet 0.6 mm and select this end and opposite direction this end. Select OK. Now we will choose circular pattern and select this two cut out and fillet. Select this axis. We want to make seven number of pattern so select OK. Now we will make mirror of this body. So select this back surface, go to reference geometry, choose plane. We want to create a one plane here. Select distance 3.7 mm. Choose OK. Now select mirror and select this body. And plane is already selected. OK. Select here merge solid, unmerge this solid because both the bodies are separated, not attached. OK. Hide this plane. Now see our patterns are created. Now select right axis section view section view little choose ok now this back surface select a sketch normal now here we will create some geometry Now select this circle, outer circle, click convert entities. Now choose spline and we want to create some geometry in between this. So select this line, this point and this point. Now exit. Now again choose spline, select this point. exit now select three point arc and we want to draw a half circle here now exit just take it back delete this again choose a half circle this is what we like now exit uh, do one thing just little move this geometry there this point also little drag ok choose stream entities and select trim this outer circle ok now choose circular sketch pattern select this as a axis point select this all the cancel choose trim entities and trim this outer line also this line also Okay. Now choose circular pattern. Select this center point as a axis and select this your profile. We want some 35 number of profiles. But make sure it will not touch these holes. Yeah, this I think this is better. It is not touching in any holes. Select OK. Now choose extruded boss. 
वी वॉन्ट टू मेक सेवन एम एम एक्सट्रूड अप टू सेवन एम एम सेलेक्ट ओके सी दिस इज द्रेक फिंस रेडी सेक्शन व्यू नाउ सी द ब्रेक्स बॉडी ऑलमोस्ट रेडी लुक एट दिस फिंस रेडी इन साइड द ब्रेक डिस्क now let's move for further operation now we will cut the back surface so choose back surface sketch normal select circle and draw one circle and assign diameter 106.69 select extruded cut only up to 4.5 mm not through all okay see it is cut now choose top plane sketch section view okay choose normal exit better choose if we will go for section okay top view sketch again select section view okay now select normal now here we will create some geometry draw a center line exit choose line again draw a line here select this line for construction now choose a line and draw a line here exit now define the angle between these two lines keep 2 degree and distance from here to this line keep 4.5 mm now choose line and start to draw from here to this point and connect to this point now exit now again choose a line and draw a parallel line to this select these two lines make parallel assign distance between these two lines keep 2 mm okay now select this line drag this line up to here select this line horizontal choose a smart dimension and the distance from here to this line keep length 15 mm okay now drag down this line also
and the distance from here to this center line 88.79 mm okay by 2 that's it make little here choose trim entities trim this side and this inside we only want up to this much okay select line and connect from here to this line exit again connect this line exit now keep the distance to mm select okay close this point choose the line and uh, we want to select from here okay trim entities and trim this line select okay now select circular sketch pattern select this pattern axis about this patterns are closed select unselect thin feature okay now see section view now our select this surface a sketch normal draw two circles here one small one and one big one the bigger one select for construction okay now assign diameter 26 mm and the bigger one keep 48 mm select a small circle and draw some circle here and keep the diameter 6.7 mm okay select circular pattern choose this axis and we want five number of holes so select okay now choose extrude cut this five holes and this bigger hole select okay now we will save our create new folder desktop new folder this break now this one select part disk save now this part is save this is the disk i hope you enjoyed this part and don't forget to share and like our videos now we will sketch second part of body uh, disk break casting body so let's start choose same right plane sketch draw a center line select a line and draw a line also select this line for construction geometry draw a circle 
draw two circles inside diameter keep 174.54 and the outer one keep 190 select line draw a line horizontal line and keep the distance between these two lines 65 mm okay now choose trim entities select this outer line now we will uh, make the casting body here choose line connect it up to here now exit choose three point arc choose a line now select three point arc now exit just drag this here select this line as a construction you can define any dimension here it's up to you it's uh, not any hard and fast uh, rule connect it up to here and draw a vertical line up to now define some corner radius one mm Two mm. It's quite little bigger. This is better. Okay. Choose line and little expand it and connect it up to here. now mirror this line mirror this all lines plus this line mirror about this line choose okay select trim entities okay now here also we will draw a same geometry draw a line up to this point exit choose line select this point now 
connect these lines with these lines exit choose stream entities delete these points okay choose line it is up to you uh, whatever dimensions anything you can give it here however you want to make it's up to totally you select this all corners too also okay now select this all choose trim entity and trim this also okay now select this all select this line this line this line mirror about this line choose okay now make sure this geometry is complete not incomplete these lines are extra just delete it now connect these lines exit now select this line as a construction line now this our geometry is ready select extruded boss select 26 mm okay now choose shell 3 mm select all these back surfaces Keep three mm. Okay. Okay. Just edit. Keep three point five mm. And remove this end end shell. I think no. We need it. okay select okay now see the body is almost ready now choose now select top plane a sketch normal now we will create some geometry so choose center line and draw from one end to this end exit again choose center line and draw from one end one midpoint to another midpoint exit now choose center rectangle and draw one rectangle in center point assign this height 5 mm now choose corner rectangle and draw from one end to another end now assign length 45 mm and the height width 19 mm okay now select this three lines and choose symmetric relation okay now select this three point lines and click mirror entities and mirror about this center line okay now select trim entities and trim on necessary outer part
ओके नाउ सेलेक्ट एक्सटूडेड कट सेलेक्ट दिस पार्ट दिस पार्ट कीप रिवर्स डायरेक्शन वी वांट टू कट थ्रू ऑल सेलेक्ट ओके सी वी कट फ्रॉम इनसाइड नाउ लेट्स मूव फॉर अनदर नाउ सेलेक्ट दिस फेस स्केच नॉर्मल नाउ सेलेक्ट लाइन एंड ड्रॉ ए लाइन फ्रॉम हियर ड्रॉ अप टू हियर चूज सेंटर लाइन एंड फर्स्ट ड्रॉ ए सेंटर लाइन ओके choose a line go back and draw s again draw a half circle up to this line okay now select this this all line mirror about this line Okay now select this line select each and every line here because we want to convert entities don't forget any line choose convert entities chamfer 5 milli okay now select extruded boss select this and this uncheck thin feature and select only up to 6 mm or let's make 5 mm okay edit make 4 mm choose fillet 1 mm select this face select this face close now again choose fillet 1 mm okay choose one by one close this asking too large so it make 0.5 mm edit select this point and here select 0.25 0.5 mm okay now select this face sketch normal choose a center line draw one rectangle just mirror about this axis select okay select extruded cut 
वी वॉन्ट टू कट ऑनली नॉट थ्रू ऑल फ्यू नाउ सी इट इज कट नाउ सेलेक्ट दिस फेस स्केच नॉर्मल सेलेक्ट सर्कल एंड ड्रो वन सर्कल हियर Keep diameter 1.5 mm, and this also 1.5 mm. Okay. Select this center line and this center line. Same. Okay. Now select extruded cut. choose through all okay edit make diameter 2 mm okay now i exit from the sketch now this 2 mm selected now we will create some planes here select this right plane choose plane make create one plane 13 mm see it, it is the middle of this okay now select plane choose this axis and select this axis uh no it's uh, not possible uh okay choose front plane plane select zero okay Now we created two planes here. Now select the color. We will assign some solid color. start in finish stainless steel and the color okay so this is the color okay now hide it or we need it in our uh, save as a caliper now we will do one thing we will just create some screws here select select this face a sketch select this circle convert entities choose extruded boss cancel it select this circle also convert entities now choose extruded boss choose reverse direction and keep 26 mm Okay. Now assign color. For them, choose blue. Okay. And the rest of body, we will again define some 
new color because uh, we are not satisfying this colors okay now save as now let's go for assembly new assembly okay now browse the part first select disk open now disk coming so click here this choose this view origin and meet this origin <coughs> edit this part also we will assign some metal color steel polished steel or any steel now save as exit now insert another component caliper here already bring here the caliper okay now select right left plane and hold control key and left plane and choose mat select okay now select right plane of uh, disk now clear it right plane of disk go down and i think we created one plane in uh, plane 1 see it is matching or clear go to advanced mat choose width select this face back face inside this face and this face select okay okay now our disc brake is ready now you can adjust according to your requirement I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. This is the disc brake. Don't forget to share and like our videos. And subscribe our channel for more videos and more projects in SolidWorks. Thanks for watching.